Greetings comrades, Soviet Gaming here. Today we are doing something weird. We are doing the Voyage of Wonders hunting trial trail. <laughs> but we are doing it with my main account because I was uh, reckless and forgot about it. So we will do it on the main and that will be really interesting. We have the common hero scrolls and the stargazing cards in the crystal chest. And in the normal chest we have some random stuff that will be useful for your overall progression. Let's go into the adventure and see how it is. So, uh, there are some new mechanics here. This ball with the, uh, I don't know, the line of production or something. Let's go and take a look what will happen. The game will explain us as we go. Blockade, demons, yes. So, what does it do? We press on the button and it changes the direction of the ball placement. That means that if we will press the battering ram, we will be able to push this ball and break the fence. There we go. That's kind of easy and straightforward, right? Right. Can we go over here? No, there is no block. So that crystal chest is out of reach. Oh, no, it, it, it is inside of the reach. What happened? We got a, a chest with a things and we can go other way as well. Uh, that was weird. Oh yeah, while we're step standing on the button, it's going different direction. If we step out of it, it will go back. Obvious. So, okay, we got our first crystal chest. That was kind of fast. <laughs> kind of fast. And we get our first fight with the common enemies. Let's see how they are. I haven't fought this for a while. Our fantastic OP team is here and can decimate all the enemies, no problem. Let's take a look how the fight will go. Most likely, full time speed, please. Yeah, they don't stand a chance. So, we will skip all the normal fights, obviously, and we will keep the boss fight because they might be fun. Before taking the relic, it is recommended to go check out the boss. It's Hyper Gian Hero, so uh, you will need different uh, powerful heroes. So, go for overall team power, whatever you want. Alright, now, uh, after this, we have a small button over here. Let's press it. When you press it, there is a door that opens on the left. Yeah. And in order to open it, we need something over here. So, obviously, we'll have to do some puzzling over here. Um, first of all, we will use a snowball. Boom. It will stay here. Okay. Now, we'll go and take out this common enemy group because they are not supposed to be there. Done. We are getting uh, the rage spike, please. Thank you. And we are getting the chest with the something uh, dust. Really not useful. Now, we are stepping on this button over here, uh, reversing the... How is it called? The treadmill or whatever. And uh, hitting that ball on the right. Bam. There we go. We can't go back anymore. So, make sure to take the chest over here before you move on. And now, we can go to the next area. All right. What do we have over here? We have uh, we have more enemies to kill and there are more snowman thingies. You don't use this one yet. You go and take out common enemies because they are in the way. Done. Uh, getting the relic, whatever, I don't care. Um, chest with an XP. XP is useful. Now, uh, where does it go? Yeah, I think... I think... We need to use this one, but before using this snowman, I don't know if we'll get stuck or not. We would like to go and take out those elite enemies. Done and done. Yes, sunstone, please. And the chest. The chest is the main thing for us. There we go, the gold. Uh, yeah, now use this polar snowball man thingy. Boom, okay, it's there. And now we can actually press this battering ram and put this snowball on the button on the left. Bam, and that opens this door straight away. This is like the high level stuff. Now we definitely want to use this uh, Polar Snowman cannon because uh, the snowball can run down and press something over here after we will press it where we want it. Now over here uh, we have, what is this? Another ball. Oh my god, so many balls. Alright, I think I've got it. So let's use this battering ram. Why the hell not? It's right there. Pretty easy, straightforward. There is no chance of losing it bam it's here good now we gotta take out two common enemies down here let's do that and do the magic of editing and they will both disappear boo magic now uh we will take the chest over here that contains oh emblems nice use the battering ram over here bam easy and another one over here fantastic now there will be mambo jumbo boop, boop, boop. there we go the door is open before we go through the door we will go and take out those common enemies because we need the chest behind them those guys are out of the way our last uh, relic over here and the chest that contains more emblems 
Fantastic. So the door is open. We go to the next area with more puzzles, more balls and more everything. Why this one is over here? Hmm. Okay. This one looks a little bit more complex, so we gotta be really careful what we do here, otherwise we might screw it up. This looks really complex and dangerous, so the first thing we wanna do, I think, we will use this battering ram on the left. Bam. 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 There we go, we hit the button, and this one is on the top. This one is on the right. And the door is open at the top. This is, wow, a lot a lot of stuff happening after this we will go to the right and take out all the enemies here and the chest so we'll start with this elite enemy because otherwise we might really miss it get the chest this one have the purple shards that's really good and another elite enemy group done uh the relic let's get this one and here we got the chest now let's tap on this button and see what will happen all right, we can uh, use this thing right now. So let's use this battery ram once. Boom. We got this one going. It's stuck over there, but that's not enough. We will use it once again. Boom. There we go. Now two of the balls are over there. And after this, we will go and press on this battery ram. I'm pretty sure that this is the right thing. Uh, things moved. We are shooting this. It's on the button. Magic! The door is open. That's really good. Okay, okay, okay. That's not it. Now we gotta go on the left over here and pull this railroad switch. Let's do that. Okay. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Alright, let's get the chest behind it. We got the emblems. Nice. And now, I think... This is the time to use the last polar snowman in the middle. If you use it before, you will have to restart the game because... Otherwise, you'll get stuck. There we go. So now this one is over there and uh, we can we can move over there, I think, right? Yeah, we can. Good. Really good. There we go. We are on this side and we can access the boss now. Let's take out those elite enemies. Oof, that was one hell of a puzzle over there. I didn't expect that one to be so complex. Now we can get through the gate and take out another elite enemy group. Done and done. Uh, let's get this artifact. Relic and the last gym enemies. Finally. Whoo! I thought that I'll screw up. They are not as strong though, so they are a little bit stronger than we are. Let's take a look how the fight will go. We can actually replace this truly with someone better, like uh Tessie here for the crowd control, and let's see how it will go. Most likely it won't go anywhere. Well, the I decided to take out the enemies really fast. Tessie is dead though. Interesting. Let's take it slow. So we want to lose it. Uh, that's dangerous. That's dangerous. The enemies are taking out some of my heroes. Didn't expect that. Now we got only Mihir against us. And, oh, we got the Lord of Time as well. Ainz, come on. We trust in you. God damn it. No way. Oh! Woo! Almost got me. Alright, we gotta change the team combination a little bit. If you guys are stuck here, you can always use mercenaries, of course. But I won't do that. That's way too easy. I will use something of my own. Uh, Saros. Saurus is the only thing that will take enemies apart faster than Ainz. So we got a single target focused guy over here right now. Uh, let's see how it will go. I hope it will go really well. Moreover, he will kill us a little bit more. So that should be really, really good thing to do. Uh, yeah, Aegis is dead. Now we can rampage with our ultimates, no problem. Yeah, the difference is like really crazy, like night and day as you can see here. Uh, let's wait for that uh, Time Lord to appear again. Come on and take him out, no problem. Bam! Fight happens again! And this time, I hope it will be just as easy for us. We are releasing our ultimates again, taking out the enemies, doing mambo jumbo, magical stuff. Saurus, twins, yes, Saurus is alive and well, enemies are slowly dying. Another Ainz ultimate, and they should be down in a few seconds. Bam. Easy. Well, not really easy. I was really surprised that the enemies managed to take me out. Ainz did crazy damage here. Uh, there we go. We got the crystal chest. That contains... Go away, guys. That contains the stargazing cards. Congratulations, guys. Uh, the hunting trial is one... Hunt no, not. It's not 100% completed. We skipped the chest. <gasps> Where did we miss the last chest? Alright, I'm an idiot, guys. So, we skipped one chest over here. Let's go and take it. Good thing that we can go 
backwards over here on this uh, treadmill. Also, taking those guys out before the last fight will be easier, like, uh, because you will get the relics. All right, there we go, the last one. Doesn't matter what we pick here. And we got our final chest, yes! <laughs> wow, that was embarrassing, guys. Anyway, hunting trial is 100% completed now. Let me know in the comments what do you think about this Voyage of Wonders adventure. I liked it a lot. The puzzle at the end was really frustrating a little bit, so yeah, you require it requires a little bit of thinking. The rewards are normal, so nothing special over there. While we go into the comments, don't forget to like the video, share it with your friends and guildies, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Make sure to hit the bell button so you won't miss any new videos. And check the video description and the pinned comment for more FK arena guides, playlists like hero breakdowns and other guides. Join my Discord, it's fantastic. A lot of people over there are talking about AFK arena and random stuff. You'll find some friends over there. I'm always there to talk with you. And of course, follow my social media, it's over there as well. And I think that's it. Yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Soviet out. До свидания.